Hey buddy, it's for new star and today we're going to be doing a new tutorial on how to do a top-down shooter. Now this is going to be similar to Shadowgrounds or any of the top-down Android games or um, I know there's a couple of new ones out made by the Unreal Engine. Um, so what we're going to do is, we I just started up because so we have a new one, a uh, new scene. We have our default cube. I'm going to add a plane that we can walk on. It's going to be 100 by 100 cubes and we're gonna repeat the texture 10 times and tile count in case we want hills or something like that I'm gonna say it's gonna be 20 so we're gonna lower it just below and I'm gonna change the texture so it's gonna be a floor texture and we have a cube now we're gonna add a camera it's gonna be a simple camera nothing special and to do this actual feature, you're going to need to download a new plugin that was made uh, by the creator of the engine. And I'll put the link down below for that. But uh, I'm going to go into behaviors, going to add scripted behavior, third person shooter player. And you're going to put this in, you, sh you should have a folder called documents and something called copper cube. And you're going to see something called plugins and you're going to see them both folders. I just put them in both. Um, so we have a camera. Actually, you want to uh, add this to the actual object. So skip the behaviors and then third person shooter. Select camera. Okay, and then you can edit all this stuff later. Um, I'm going to move this over or a wee bit away. This is still in its beta process. You just released a quick code. Um, so there may, might still be some bugs. But it's finally allowed me to uh, start working on a top-down shooter tutorial for you guys. Okay, so we're going to do it in Windows mode. As you can see, it's rotating to us. And then we can just move wherever we want. So it's not perfect, but it's a start. And then you can start doing a animated character and have the character move and shoot and all that stuff, which we'll actually be doing. So I'll be setting up a menu, a story background, and all that stuff, which I already have one. So we're going to be skipping from this to that with the animated character and scene and all that stuff. So this was just a quick intro into how to do a top-down shooter. Again, I'm going to do a put a link down below where you can download it, and it will work with the older versions of Copper Cube to the newer ones. Um, and I will see you in the next tutorial. Bye, guys.